Hey everybody, Rodman here. Thanks for tuning in to Silver Fang Vengeance. If you need a recap of the rules and goals, here they are. And let's get going. So last episode, I was attempting to replace Leth's arm, and I did just that. As you can see, he's got his arm back. Now the only issue is, in the process, uh, Jimmy lost his hand. So, I am almost back to square one. I was uh, tapping into uh, this Ancient Danger here. And the idea is to now try for this Ancient Danger next. Um, after opening both Ancient Dangers, uh, we might go ahead and take some prisoners for sale. Back home, uh, Day's been cooking up a... Uh, well, I guess he's um, actually mining right now. But he has been cooking up a bit of a storm of uh, statues. Uh, trying to get more of the... Um, you know, more of the statues uh, made so that he could potentially, uh, well, we could potentially win, I think is the, the best way to put it. Uh, but for now, I think I'm going to leave Jimmy up to the statue crafting. We're in the middle of winter. Um, and let's see, what are some other status effects? So day here uh, is a Lucy addict. Uh, Jimmy is missing a whole lot of everything. The funny thing is he's a masochist, and despite all of his injuries, he has no pain. So it's not even like all of those injuries make him happy. Pretty silly, right? Um, Artie has a wooden foot. Yeah, I think that that's about the extent of it. Uh, one thing I realized I need to do is to crank out a bunch of simple meals. Don't care with what Yan Shui, you better get working on that. Yeah, we don't really have a source of food at the moment. And uh, as such, people are low-key starving. There we go. Now there's going to be a little bit of a food poison risk unless we tidy up this teeny little temporary shack. And then, of course, we are also, um, you know, on the ground. Ooh, elk. Self-tamed. I could just butcher that for even more food. Oh, Chief just got hurt because he collapsed roof on himself. I was pretty sure I told him to remove roof before that, but uh, clearly not. And Bear just got infected. Oh boy, this is turning into all sorts of goodness. Um, Alright, let's tend to Chief. That cut looks pretty serious. He's bleeding kind of everywhere. Alright, there we go. And the bear is getting tended to. Another thing I could do to make sure that this bear, named Bear, um, survives would be to slap down a uh, little bed so that he can heal uh, more effectively. So ideally, well, let's see. Ideally, uh, he would rest up and, you know, I'd survive as a result. All right, the next thing I want to do is the, uh, maybe make it a wooden door. Wooden doors break real easy, but allow us to flee quite fast. And then a steel door. And this time a whole bunch of steel walls going this way. Come on, bear. Get in the bed. Heal, your, heal yourself. They're not known for their intelligence, I suppose. That's probably longer than I need it to be. Actually, given the size of this ancient danger, maybe not. Given my luck and all. Alright, Mr. Bear, I am going to restrict you to area one. That means... No animal beds available. I'm like literally staring at one. This bear is very confused as to how to rest or whatever. I don't know actually what's going on. But uh, I'll reinstall this animal bed and uh, hopefully the bear will, will recover. I don't know. Bear's being a little foolish, if you ask me. Alright, Leth is back to mining. Chief is constructing up 
what I need here. And soon we will have the ability to crack into that other ancient danger. How is my home team? You are cleaning up bodies, corpses. Ugh, that's a wee bit gross. Um, let's go ahead and grab Molotovs and assist the situation. Getting a little tired of the super windy snow sound. How are we doing in here? We are most of the way. Just a little bit more work to do. All right. So Zero is going to burn up these corpses. Most of these corpses don't even have enough uh, HP to stick around. So that should not be much of an issue. Uh, Bear is resting, but not in the sleeping box. Uh... All right, whatever. Maybe it doesn't fit? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. He's been weird. All right, so they all took a break. And then come tomorrow morning, um, we will go ahead and finish off this little construction project. Setting a whole bunch of traps for our uh, ancient danger spelunkers to crack into. That should be fun. Making sure that the fires don't go out, because it is a pretty cold winter. Deep into the negatives. Oh, and this fire's out. Hold bedrooms ahead, that's all I can say. Right. At this point, I would say that's probably all of the steel I need. Uh, cargo pods coming down. T, perfect. It's gonna be actually quite handy, keeping our folks happy. Look how now they build the torch. All right, so there is um, it's a little too cold in this crafting room. Um, so I am going to make even more. Uh, be, you know, it's so cold that it's not even a, a good temperature for uh, sculpting. I don't really care what we name this. Balbaker seems fine to me. All right, so now we are going to haul the slag or the chunk out of there. And then lay the traps down one at a time from the back. Then we'll be ready to go. No, don't go that way. Perfect. I could not have planned that better. Oh, no, I guess I have one extra, but that's all right. Well, the bear is resting up. Um, infection. Oh, bear is not going to do well. Um, I'm going to use the Glare World Medicine and see if I can't get that bear to not die. Um, let's see, work. I have someone as an animal handling. Whatever happened to the elk or whatever I had? Hmm. Set up a steel butcher table. I don't care about bad temperature. Work speed is not much of a concern. Ah, oh, Mr. Bear. Uh, what is it? Right leg? Yeah, I'd rather not. Amputate your leg if I could help it. Now, there's also wargs around, so I gotta be careful as... To not allow my other people to be a uh, target of a predator. Alright, Yanchwe here should be butchering. No, I don't want you butchering insects. Scratch that. Uh, no insect corpses. Whatever happened to that uh, elk? There it is. Oh no, raccoons, don't be using my 
trap hallway, please. Pretty please. Now we have enough for an animal bed out of plain leather. And the bear switches. Okay, I guess it's just the box. Uh, smaller animals fit in it, but not the bigger ones. Oh no, not again. Uh, ignore roof. Ignore roof. There we go. We are just about ready to go. Come on. I told you to ignore roof. And just re roof it again. Yo, crazy. Psychic drone low here. That's not good. Uh, zero. You're making a. No, you're just sitting there. Okay. Um, I thought this was the gather spot. You were gathering around here because I haven't turned that off. There we go. No longer gather spot. I'm smoothing this out just for the construction skill level ups. No other reason. So, Chief is fully healed and ready to go. Uh, how is Bear doing? 84, 91. Ooh, that's not comfortable. I don't know. I've done a really bad job about Bear here. That's all I can say. Uh, looks like... Looks like I'm going to drink some Psychite tea with everybody and... Then pop open an Ancient Danger or something. It's funny that there's a drone here and a Soothe at home. Can't decide what should go wrong. Alright, even given the uh, honestly crazy amount of campfires I've set, it is still very cold. Um... Zelda and Wolf sleeping in pretty frigid temperatures. I am not going to lie. I'm trying to light it all up. Alright, so Chief is ready to go. Come on, bear. Yeah, yes, he did it. 97 to 100%. I love it. Alright, let's get going. So, Mr. Leth, you are going to stand here. Uh, one of these. Oh, perfect. I, it's like I had planned for that rat to do that. Uh, the rat tripped the trap. But I have one spare trap, so. Magnificent. Alright, so this should close. Well, not right now. But Chief and Yanshui. Leth. And, of course, we're looking for something that can uh, give Jimmy's hand back, whether it be heal mech serum. And then, of course, um, aside from that, uh, the possibility of res mech serum, because we do have Trekintosh dead. So, we got a Soothe, a Bonic Eye, Glitter World, but no, nothing, nothing we actually needed, which is too bad. All right, so this thing is an Inferno Launcher and is coming for us. Come on, please step to the end here. That was a good shot. Somehow, Chief didn't even get hit by it. All right, come on, monster. It's not a monster, I know, but we'll pretend it is. Please come into all the traps. Yes, there we go. This will make it a lot easier. Didn't even need to kill it. Well, you know, fight it manually. All right, so at this point, um, we are ready to do some prisoner stuff. Uh, one thing I might want to do is to carry home all of the goods I have here, including Bear, drop them off, and then come back uh, for those prisoners. Um, Yeah, no, I don't know. Can my guys take out prisoners by themselves? I think they can. 
I'm going to leave them here and have them work that out by themselves. So I'm going to put a little um, door here. All right, let's go ahead and remove the roof over all this. So the idea I have for the prison is just to wall them off and pick them off one at a time. That should be pretty easy. I'm not going to ensure that they're perfectly healthy or whatever. I'm just going to bash them over the head with Chief. Uh, there is a raid. They're dropping directly on top of me, right where Angel is. That's interesting. Yeah, they, um, so the way the raids work, I'm sure you, most of you already know. Uh, they just sort of pick someone at random to drop attacks on. And, uh, this time it was Angel, which is actually really convenient because she is nowhere near the base. I'm going to have her take cover in here. Put, uh, closing the granite door behind her. Uh, Klein and Wolf are not in the base. And given the weapons that these raiders have, I'm gonna just hang out here. Day zero. Who's, you're already hucking grenades at me? Oh, wow, you just hucked grenades at your friend there. All right, well, they're gonna blow up my, like, little stone cutter area but you know small price to pay and all all right jimmy let's have you stay put all right we're grabbing everything out of there i don't really need to pay attention to those groups all right christine is going for jimmy with a revolver jimmy just get behind some cover crab is getting attacked i don't like that uh, Klein, go for Crab. Wolf, kill Christina. Jimmy, go after the Grenadier. That should be pretty easy. Alright, Crab got knocked down. Tail and paw destroyed. Very not cool, guys. Uh, Jimmy's in a brawl with the Grenadier. I have faith in him, I guess. Wolf is just standing out in the open, because he's crazy, but good kind of crazy. All right, Wolf's going to cover Klein. Klein's going to back up. Please don't get friendly fired. Oh, and now they're fleeing. Cool. Uh, Angel released. Jimmy released. Jimmy won that fight pretty swiftly. Uh, bruised to the neck. Uh, and then I just need to rescue Crab. Rescuing Crab with my best doc. Alright, so the idea here is to uh, wall these off from one another. Uh, I don't even care if I can get in there. Uh, I'm just doing it so that I can... I probably only need to do it like that. Let me, uh, let me make sure... Well, let's see. I will test on the one smaller Ancient Danger. I might only need to wall that off like this. That'd be cool if that was the case. And we'll run a test. At least he didn't build himself into that. Oh, no. They could get out the back. Okay. If that's the case, uh, let's wall this one in. Finish that up. Alright, Crab's no longer incapable of walking. In fact, Crab has been patched up. Missing a paw or two, because those guys suck. But, you know, these, these things happen. Alright, so I think we're just about ready. Leth, are you ready? More cargo pods coming down. Some leaves at the home tile. Be useful. All right, so we're here to take some slaves. And let's open up this casket. 
All right, two of them are already dead, and two of them are unconscious, so that's going to be pretty, pretty easy. Um, what I will do is turn this into a prison. Man, I could not have asked for easier. Now, there's a possibility, of course, that these guys have bionics. No, they don't. All right, Yan Shui, time to capture and capture. But they do have um, fancy, fancy resources which I otherwise would not have access to. So I think the plan is to, yeah, we'll patch them up, and uh, I guess there's already an airlock here. We'll patch them up and um, treat them like the prisoners that they are. Uh, one thing I'm probably going to need to do here is to set some campfires. And then um, maybe bury uh, some of the, uh, the, the two that were dead on arrival. All right, another thing I probably want to do, wildlife. Let's go hunt the grizzly bear. Yanshui is going to get that done because I'm going to need the food. All right, I know this is a terrible, terrible job for you, chief, but I'm going to have you clean this place up. As a prison cell, it looks pretty gross. Jimmy. You just got punched once. Uh, but that should actually make you happy. Alright, so we have another grand statue here. Get that installed. Artie and Zelda. Let's get the lights on. I have 1600 wood and you can't spare a moment. Uh, animals, let's get you all to no pets allowed. And your stargazing, could you hunt? Where is the grizzly? Ah, here it is. She came all the way, all this way. I'm just going to force her, even though she's tired. Very easy. All right, we'll run for butchers. Uh, nope, not going to offer safety to anyone. Not at this moment. So slug and pain. Good names. Um, all right. This one's next. I'm glad my bear survived. That was close. Uh, at this point, I should probably give you no actual meds, and we'll just uh, butcher this thing tomorrow. I don't want to push people too, too hard. All right, what is with the lack of hauling here? Uh, Klein, Angel, Wolf. Going to queue that up. I don't know why they're not just refueling. Because it is really, really cold, and they just don't want to do it. All right, so now uh, we got a bear. We're going to have a little bit more food. I have no idea why I'm cleaning up vomit, but whatever. Uh, no place to store it. Okay, so... Um, I think for my mental sake, um, I'm going to use the uh, pulser here because every well, not we're not that low on mood, but uh, I'd rather not run a risk or anything. Right, there's a mad rat. Well, we have the rat puncher right here, so done. <laughs> He's now got architect arms and all that, so. It's a wee bit easier than it was before. Back of the home tile. Let's allow all. 
There's some corpses around. It looks like we already repaired this place up. That's pretty fast. I didn't even really queue them up to do it. Uh, good job, Chief. Figured you would end up doing something like that. Alright, now they're all isolated. And... Yanshui just finished resting. There's a Psychic Soothe here, so there's two Psychic Soothes. There's the Strange Feeling Psychic Soothe, and then the regular one. We should uh, be plenty happy now. Uh, inside here, let's go ahead and expand this. This is becoming a semi-permanent structure. Unintentionally. Alright. We're good to go. For prison number two. Alright, maybe there'll be more of a fight this time. Or someone with bionics. Alright, Vera here, no bionics. Lumi, none, none, none. And Blackjack has a leg. Okay. Uh, let's go melee attack. Died, but you know, I don't care. They're slaves to me. If we uh, get them. Alright, so I walled them off so that I could deal with them sort of one at a time, as you see here. Oh, another one dead. If I wanted them not to die, I would have obviously uh, set this scenario up that, you know, we weren't using such powerful weapons. Really, I should have Leth sit out, uh, truth be told, because he is so damn strong. So this guy is naked. Oh, and you start firing. Did you hit Yanshui? No, you didn't. Okay. Alright, I'd like to try to get Blackjack because he's got, uh... He's got that Bonic leg. Left do with deal with Jude. All right, Yanshui, have you back up? Have a uh, chief tap in because you got your finger destroyed, man. I came for um, I came for the ability to find weapons, and I'm going to or uh, uh, you know body parts, and I'm going to end up having fewer body parts as a result. Okay, great, you killed him. Well, that didn't work. Let's see if Yuzuki can uh, survive the the Leth here. At this point, I don't even uh, I don't even care. Kill her if you want. Oh, you knocked her unconscious. Well, she has marine armor and synthread stuff, but of course, we part of the rules can't you know steal the the loot of would be. Uh, slaves or whatever, so she gets to keep it. I think the body organs was the exception, but, um, you know, whatever. Alright, time to get out of this whole area, and I'm gonna have to find some additional, uh, ooh, don't leave that there. Uh, in fact, we, this heavy SMG should probably just get destroyed, so I'm going to do just that. Weapons, range, because I'm not supposed to have it. Uh, heavy SMG. Just going to put it outside. All right, Yanshui, I wanted you in here so that you could patch yourself up a little faster, more easily, whatever. Chief, you are... you don't need that. Yanshui got an Inspired Trade, and I also got an Eclipse. She's almost done patching herself up, and then let... Whoa! Oh yeah, that whole room's gonna go up. Alright, now that weapon's out... Eh, I guess I'll leave the, uh... I'll leave the meals. I don't really need them. 
I can make my own. Alright, uh, I'm going to drink some tea. Tend to my friends. And... How is day and his art going? 22... Yeah, every time I check, it seems like there's barely anything left to do for whatever art that we're working on. That's a very common theme. Alright, so she can move again. She hasn't been patched up, but it was only bruises. This whole uh, room is gone. The corpse is gone. How are you starving? Didn't you just eat? Making sure that this is not a home zone, because I don't really care if it burns. Uh, ideally, I would wait a little bit longer. Oh, you know what? I I do have a warden. Leth, you're the warden. Uh, ideally, I would wait a little bit longer for them to heal up. That way, it's uh, faster for me to carry them home. But, um... But I don't mind limping home slow. It's not that big of a deal. Okay, well, uh, pretty unsuccessful. All we did is manage to lose a finger. I guess we did gain three slaves, but we had a shot at, um... Oh, zero thrown a party. We had a shot at possibly getting a, uh, a bonic leg and botched that one, too, because the, the dude was beating the hell out of, uh... Beating the hell out of Yanshui, so I had to sub, him in, sub uh... You know, a lot of damage in. Whatever, it happens. Alright, crab's fully healed. Gonna be limping a little bit due to the one dog leg left, but, uh, you know. It's better than nothing. Oh, wow. Okay, we are going through our wood supply fast. Where is it? I guess it's here. Yeah. Yeah, we're going through it pretty quick. Most, a lot of these shelves were empty. Should have forbid that steel too. I don't really care if it get carried. Uh, so we have a bonnet guy that we got out of this all. That's not terrible. Alright, the other issue I foresee is that slug and pain here are gonna freeze to death the moment I start to caravan them home. So uh, let's go ahead, check who walks real fast. Wolf, all right. Wolf, you are going to bring some clothing to our new prisoners. So, Wolf and some clothing. So, two dusters, two pants, two shirts, two toques, and rendezvous to us. Yeah, there's really no sense in feeding and caring for uh, prisoners to only have them freeze to death on the way home. So, we'll patch them up. Now, if I wanted to recruit them, not that I can, because I can only recruit family members, um, they would be really, really easy. Alright, uh, spaceship chunk. I think there should be a statue. Yep, there it is. I was going to say there should be a statue around here because I watched him finish. Yeah, Wolf, Wolf should be here. Oh, no, are you going to rest? Don't rest, please. Just run all the way. Come on. You can make it. So the tomb is um, up to almost 220. We're getting pretty close to uh, the goal here, and then we just need to finish off the, uh, you know, pretty much finish off the, um, 
the two last pirate bases, which are really not that tall of an order. At least we don't have a uh, centipede trying to murder us. All right. Now, once um, they all wake up, I will caravan them home. And yeah, I know some of the clothing is lying outside, but it's only going to be outside for another hour or so. Alright, we're going to wait to come home on Yansh Yanshui's schedule and not Wolf's. Little Soul Flare is not going to stop me. Alright, Yanshui's up. So, form caravan. Everybody, everyone. And I suppose I can take a whole lot of this good stuff back with me. The Bionic Eyes, the Lances, uh, the Triple Launcher, the SMG staying here because it's not mine. I'll take the clothing and then once the prisoners are part of the caravan, I can throw the clothing on their body. Um, yep. Choose root. And once we get back and have people heal up, uh, I can then redeploy for um, for our, uh, possibly finding another arm. That was a bad placement. Uh, expand. I also realized that I hadn't queued up the um, sleeping spots to be moved. So I'm going to quickly uninstall those. Right, there we go. Now, these prisoners just need to exit the, the map tile. I know they're get, becoming hypothermic quick, but... Um, it's easier to throw clothing on when they're in a caravan. A lot of things in this game are harder to do in caravanning, but uh, throwing clothing on a prisoner is actually easier. Funny enough. All right, so uh, now that you can see them here, I can just force clothing on them. Oops. There. Obviously don't want to force the triple launcher. And uh, yeah, we're all set. They're going to come home and not be uh, frozen. And that, unfortunately for me, uh, that marine armor is not mine either. Uh, I don't get to keep it. We're towards the end of winter. This is going to start warming up a little bit in the base. These bedrooms looking pretty toasty, which is nice. I will allow sewing. Uh, we got a mad muffalo. Oh, that's on a map tile I no longer care about. So, um, abandoned. Alright, prisoners are here. Uh, as far as wardening goes, no longer allow the... the people that have no interest in wardening to warden anymore. These uh, prisoners will be worth more money if they fully heal up, so I should uh, wait before selling them. And my wardens are now hauling them off to prison. Uh, that also means that I'm going to need some additional uh, beds. Alright, so the prison is... I probably already had uninstalled beds or whatever, but oh well. Doesn't really matter. Leth, you got... Oh, your... Yeah, your shield belt's tattered apparel. You're going to keep that on. I like how these prisoners are, like, voluntarily walking towards the prison. Ew. You guys eating kibble? Why would you do that? Alright, already an angel. Would you be so kind as to, uh... Haul our prisoners to prison. They'll heal up a lot faster when they're actually laying in a bed. 
And I should probably close the steel door as well. Because, you know, we don't want them getting out. For now, I can just reduce resistance. All this serves to do is level up my own uh, social skills. Um, using the prisoners to my benefit. But we're really just waiting on Yuzuki to heal up. Um, and then we'll go... Uh, so you, no pets allowed for the bear. Still going to be trained up to haul. Very happy that I got a bear. Very cool, too. Very fortuitous. Happened right when I needed one, right? Alright, Yanshui's healing up. Had pretty bad medical coverage. Medical tending because she was injured when she was doing it. But, uh, you know, what can you do? Uh, Chief is very quickly replacing the clothing that I just used um, for the prisoners. So that's not going to be an issue at all. It's actually a good thing because he's uh, his crafting falls if I don't constantly sort of use his skills. And then what I could do is send Yanshui, Chief, and uh, Leth to go ancient danger hunting yet again. Uh, looks like I have another statue. Yeah, here it is. All right, 219. Soon to be, what, 220, I guess, I hope. We get, like, one point per grand statue. It's pretty ridiculous uh, diminishing returns, but that's just how it is. No complaints for me. It was set high because it's a proper challenge, right? All right? Chief's already moving that. Yanshui looks fully healed. That was really, really fast. Um, especially for the just wooden bed that I had. So, we're at, yeah, 220. Uh, let's go ahead and form caravan. Uh, it's 20 o'clock. It's, eh, uh, no, we'll, we'll form a caravan. I don't care. Um, so, Leth, Yanshui, and Chief... Actually, just curious. Oh, Chief's already made a bunch of the replacement clothing. So yeah, I can have Chief, Chief go. Leth, Chief, Yanshui. And uh, 300 PEMs. And that should be enough. I really probably, other than bed rolls, don't need much else. All right, there we go. Ew, guys, I don't know why you're eating kibble. Like, I would feed you fine meals. You just seem to want to eat the kibble. Uh, and then, of course, um, Zelda here is going to escort these prisoners uh, and probably bring whatever I have to sell to sell. I'm not entirely sure what I have to sell, but we can um, clear out our inventories a little bit. Uh, Wolf, you are going to get a Bonic Red Eye. And I'm going to install it with the best possible meds I have. And Zero, you're going to go operate. I'm using the Glitter World Medicine so there's no accidents. Whoa, 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 whoa. So, 53 tukes for a minigun. Oh, man, that, uh, that speaks to me on a deep, deep level. This has just been... Uh, this has been a uh, series of tribals using miniguns like crazy. I don't know why. So, Tukes, I'll make you out of the cloth. I'll keep the wool for myself. If I have to go buy cloth on my slave run, uh, I could do that. Alright, so these guys are resting on the road. I figured they would. Wolf now is a recipient of a Bionic Eye. He should be much happier. Enchanted, yes. Uh, much happier with that result. And uh, that is about all the time I have, guys. So, uh, if you have any tips, tricks, feedback for me, drop me a line. And uh, 
maybe uh, wish me good luck. My next um, Ancient Danger spelunking. I really hope that I don't lose more fingers and hands in the uh, attempt to put things back together. Thank you all for watching. I'll catch you all later. Adios.